Welcome back to the Mullings YouTube f What the hell? Why can't I get the words right? Welcome back guys to the Mullings YouTube channel. Today is our first episode or our first vlog that we filmed for you guys. Um, we're trying to get the girls to go to sleep at night and just leave us alone and sleep the whole night through. So we're having to come up with a few different strategies to make this happen. This is our third attempt at getting the girls to sleep in their own beds by themselves without me or Amber um, spending the night with them. So we've got Tay and Tia a new bed. We've got to show them, surprise them. Hopefully it excites, it excites them enough to keep them down all night. I'm sure a lot of you parents can relate with not getting a good night's sleep and how important that is. So um, yeah, let's get it. So um, as Troy said, we are getting Tay a new bed today. Well, Tay and Tia, our hope is that if we get this new bed that they might actually stay in it together because at the moment, um, bedtime isn't the funniest. <laughs> Um, yeah, so let me show you what she's got at the moment. She's actually got a pretty nice setup here, but obviously it's not good enough for her since she doesn't stay in it. Um, let me show you. So this is, I'm in her room at the moment. I'll show you her bed. I know, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, wouldn't any three year old love this bed? Uh, so it's a tree house bed. Uh, we've already taken the sheets off and stuff, so that's why inside it looks like that, but it's, I'm sure you'd agree, it's a pretty decent setup. But she's had that for almost a year, and she's probably spent about a week of nights in there. Um, so what she has been using is this small bed, which she's for some reason prefers. It was against this wall, we've just moved it. Um, so she's been sleeping in here when she does actually stay in her room. But, like I said, the new bed is coming today. We haven't actually organized to get rid of this one yet, so we're just gonna put the new bed over here, which you'll see in a bit. Um, in replace of this one here. So, fingers crossed, it makes a difference to our nighttime routine. It's honestly like, so they both start off in their own beds. Tia's in her cot, Tay's in her room. Um, so they go to bed about half seven. And then we get to about, we get to about the time that we're going to bed. So about half 10, 11, and just, one by one, they just wake up. Tay is smart about it now. She wakes up and she creeps into our bed and just crawls in. Tia is not as subtle. Tia just wakes up screaming and then ends up in our bed. So sometimes we literally end up with four in a bed. Four in the bed and the little one said, roll over. That's literally what it's like. Um, if we're lucky, we can in the middle of the night pick up Tay and put her back in here. But sometimes she still just gets up again and is back in. So, fingers crossed, this new bed, it, it's a decent one, like she'll love it, and you'll see it in a bit. Fingers crossed this, we can put them both in it, and they'll stay in, but we will see. You have something new in your room? What's new in your room? A good bed. Oh, you want to see? Are you gonna be happy? Are you ready? One, two, As you can see from Tay's reaction and how they're going on now, I think we did good. I think it was a success. He is hoping that they stay in there all night, but so far, so far I'm happy. Um, yeah, so at the moment there's three beds in here. So there's a new one. There's, can you see it behind me? The old one. And then this one there, but fingers crossed they stay in this one tonight. Are you happy with your new bed? Matea, please get up into your bed. Okay. Yeah. 
Tell me what you think about your new bed. Come here, stand up. Moments later. So, this is a groundbreaking.